switches connect all computer LAN connection the same as up do. The difference is that switches can run in full duplex mode and are able to direct and filter information to and from specific destination. When architecture is with LAN, there are numerous devices associated with data information flow across a when together these devices create the infrastructure of a functional when these devices include router, ATM, switch, modem, and CSU, DSU, channel, CSU, channel, channel service unit, DSU, data service unit, communication server, multiplexer, S.25 prime relay switches. These all terms will be explained next in the next lecture. ATM switches ATM mean asynchronous transfer mode switches provide high speed transfer between both LAN and WAN ATM is a WAN technology we can say ATM is a WAN technology modem modulator demodulator what I mean modulator and demodulator so modem modulate and demodulate the signal modem convert digital and lock signal at the source modem convert digital signal to a form suitable for transmission or analog communication facilities public telephone line etc at the destination the modem convert the signal back to a digital format so it means the modem convert digital signal to analog and back from analog signal to digital csu dsu channel service unit data service unit are similar to modem however they send data in digital format across digital telephone loops they are usually in a physical box but they may come in two separate units csu or dsus multiplexers a multiplexer combine multiple signal for transmission over a single circuit this allows for the transfer of various data simultaneously such as video, sound, text, etc. Communication server. There are different type of multiplexing, and these type will be discussed in detail later. Communication servers. Communication server are typically dial-in, dial-out ser servers. That allow user to dial in from remote location and attach to the LAN. X.25 frame relay switches. X.25 and frame relay switches connect private data or public data circuit. Using digital signal, these units are very similar to ATM switches, but the transfer rate of data is not comparable. Local area network cabling. The earliest LAN use coaxial cable over time the twisted pair cable used in the telephone system was improved to carry higher frequency and support LAN traffic more recently fiber optic cable have emerged as a high speed cabling option local area network use four type of cable coaxial cable unshielded twisted pair utp stp shielded twisted pair fiber optic coaxial cable consists of a single copper conductor, a layer of shielding with a round wire and outer jacket. Coaxial cable are sometimes used for a hub bus topology, but many LAN products are dropping support of coaxial cable connectivity. The Ethernet LAN protocol was originally developed to operate over coaxial cable, 10 base 5 slash thicknet cable. 10 base 5 means 10 baseband 5 was the original Ethernet cable and is no longer in use in mod modern LAN. 10 base 2 thicknet cable has a smaller diameter than thicknet. Replace thicknet is no longer recommended but is still used in some very small LAN. Unchilly twisted pair cable is used for both LAN and telephone system. UTP cable are composed of four color coded pair of copper conductor twisted around each other. An outer jacket provide protection and keep the pair in alignment. 
UDP cable connect to devices through 8 pin modular connector called RJ45 plug so RJ means register jack all LAN protocol can operate over UTP most modern LAN devices are equipped with RJ45 jack shielded twisted fair cable is also used for data network it originated with IBM token link network its shielding allow greater tolerances for protection from EMI interferences EMI electromagnetic interference such as from fluorescent light pictures and electric motors fiber optic cable is the best for speed but it is more expensive than the previous two fiber optic cable are the latest development in cabling technology they are constructed from optical glass there is a center glass filament called the core and surrounding layer of cladding buffer coating strengthening material and an outer jacket information is transmitted by wavelength of light this is accomplished through devices that convert electrical signal into rapid pulses of either LED or laser light. Fiber optic cable offer several advantages including high bandwidth capacity many gigabit per second, longer distances between devices from 2 to over 60 km, immunity to electromagnetic interferences. Fiber optic cable are widely used in band for both voice and data communication. The primary barrier to their widespread use in LAN is the cost of electronics. Ethernet. What is Ethernet? Ethernet was developed by Xerox in 1970. It was implemented through Technet cable running at 10 Mbps. Ethernet is a connection medium access method that allows all hosts on a network to share the same bandwidth of a link. Ethernet actually just refers to the LAN implementation that includes three principal categories. Simple Ethernet 100 Mbps Ethernet and 1000 Mbps Ethernet. Ethernet are IEEE 802.3. IEEE mean Institute of Electrical and Electronic Engineering. 802.3 it is the standard. The simple Ethernet standard is IEEE 802.3. This 802.3 I will explain in later lectures. Operate at 10 Mbps on coaxial cable and twisted pair cable. It means that its speed is 10 Mbps. Next 100 Mbps inter Ethernet, also known as fast Ethernet. Operate at 100 Mbps over twisted pair cable. 1000 Mbps Ethernet also known as Gigabit Ethernet operated 1000 Mbps or 1 Gbps over fiber and twisted pair cable. Ethernet and IEEE 802.3 operation involve three basic components transmission medium access collision handling. Media access Ethernet media access uses the following process any station on a LAN can access the network at any time. Before sending data, station listen for traffic on the network. A station wait until it detects no traffic before it transmits data. Collision handling. Ethernet is a first come first serve environment. In such an environment, any station on the network can transmit whenever the network is quiet. A collision occurs when two station listen for traffic. Hear none and then transmit data at the same time. More transmission or damage and the station must be transmitted at a later time CSMACD CSMA 